and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy 7. And in the time that since we've been gone, um, I ran around, got in a few fights. Uh, what else did I do? Gathered a few more enemy skill, um, enemy skills. And uh, what else did we do? Uh, stole a new weapon for Tifa. And uh, yeah, a few other things, but. Let's carry on. What's this? We've been fighting the Shinra on this battlefield for a long time. We've still settled in for a long war with them. Could you spare some time and help us fight them? We don't want to sound pushy, so if you're busy or something, why don't you finish that first? Uh, where's Junin? Let's see, head north along the coast. Keep your way, keep going a ways, and you'll run into June. But be on, but be alert because it sits in the shadows of a small hill. All right, well, uh, <clears throat> I guess we could spare some time. Yeah, we'll help you out. Really? Then go up on, go on up, and they'll fill you in on the details. Any enemy of the Shinra is a friend in mine. Except for maybe Sephiroth, I guess. <laughs> he's kind of—he's an enemy of the Shinra, huh? All right, so I take it back. Most enemies of the Shinra are friends of mine. What's going on? Oh, now this is something. I never thought anyone would ever climb up here. Your eyes are different. Well, anyhow, and any minute now, this will be a battle battlefield against Shinra. You better get down before you get involved. You mean Shinra? What do you mean a battlefield? It appears you have a problem with Shinra too. After all, you climbed up here. Why not listen to what I have to say for a moment? Uh, yeah, I guess so. Uh, do you know what's at the top of the mountain? A huge bird. The reactor and the condor. That's right, on the mountain is a condor and a reactor. It seems Shinra doesn't like the idea of a condor on top of the reactor. What's so wrong with having a condor on top of the reactor? Why? It seems there's some type of special materia in the reactor above us. And because the condor came, Shinra and you rushed troops here. The military wants to get the condor and all the villagers off this mountain. The condor is now warming its egg, which hatches only once every few years. We would like to protect the condor from being harmed. Your lives? Condor's egg. Real work in nature. We've got to protect the life of the planet. We must protect the condor egg, right? Unfortunately, we don't have the ability to fight Shinra ourselves. That's why we've hired soldiers to help us. As our sponsor, you can help us with contribution or by fighting alongside of us. What do you think? You want to join us in our fight? Hmm. Cloud? Cloud, why are you still worrying about it? All right, let's do it. Cloud, thanks. Yes, let's, let's do our best. All right. Let's see what else you have to say. Yes, yes, I also told you the store's owners about you, so they should sell you various items. And feel free to use our beds. Sweet. Let's check out what they got in the shops. I think I need to... You hang in there. I think I need to pick up some, uh... Hypers, actually. Yeah, all out of hypers. We have plenty of money to throw around, so... Well, whatever, let's go with five. Uh, pick up a couple of them, a couple of these, uh, pick up another couple tents too. Woo, shopping spree! Hello, do your best. And yeah, I don't really think two fires, we only have one ice. Um, Pick up another ice and another restore. 
Just to have. Got that materia bling. Let's go check out these lovely accommodations. Ladies. Say, so, hey, let's rest, okay? Yeah, we'll get some rest. Save too. Let's roll. Now, for this upcoming fight, you are able to donate money and buy units to place. It's kind of it's a mini game. Uh, Ask my son who's standing on guard, who's standing guard at the shed, about anything related to our military tactics. All right, yeah, we'll go talk to this guy. We'll probably explain it all. But uh, anyway, yeah, you can dump a lot of money into this fight, and you know it's fun. All works out usually. You know, first few times I ever played this game, that's what I would do. But. After a little while, I changed my mind, and uh, now I pretty much let them invade. That's a nice view of the Condor. Uh, thanks for accepting. So, shall I let you in on our strategy? Our enemy has targeted our mountain reactor, and it will be climbing to reach it. We must set a trap and hire soldiers to protect the place. Well, this is all we have. This village doesn't have any money. Even if we wanted to fight, we couldn't because we're broke. We need 400 gil to hire one soldier. So if we hire 20 soldiers, we'll need 8,000 gil. We need you. We need to ask you uh, to use your own money to hire these soldiers, buy the equipment, set it up, and give the commands. If you don't have the time, would you help us with the donation? If you donate the money, we can hire the soldiers and block Shinra's attack. We know uh, what we're asking is selfish. We sent our wives and children to another village but we're resigned to stay. Let's get back to the basics. If the enemy reaches the shed, you'll have to fight them off immediately. It's not the end of the world, but if you lose repeatedly, it could be dangerous. Now then, is there anything you wish to ask? So, um, yeah. Uh, basically, oh, looks like they're getting ready to attack now, please. Any help is appreciated. Um... Okay, yeah, we're ready. We're not going to use any money. We're not going to place any troops. We're just going to wait for them to get up here. And we get into a sort of boss fight. So instead of losing money, you gain money and experience. So. I think you're able to place units before. And, uh... Oh, you can't place them below that line. And, uh, yeah, I guess I could just keep buying a whole bunch of units, but I'm not really interested in that. So, let's start the game. Start combat! And yeah, crank the speed all the way up. And do that by hitting R1 or L1. And so, yeah, we're getting attacked by all these polygon creatures. And, uh, yeah, this might take a little while, I guess. <laughs> um, during the battle, I think you could still place... Maybe not. Oh, wow, yeah. Okay, so that line keeps creeping up higher and higher the further the enemies approach. So you can't always place workers and, uh, you know, soldiers and stuff. But it's kind of like a game of paper, scissors, rocks. Some certain enemies are weaker against uh, certain units you have. Go faster! Oh, 
looks like this guy's probably gonna be the first one up there, so we'll just go ahead and follow him. Um, so yeah, this fight could, uh, you know, it's pretty easy to go ahead and place troops and win it uh, the way that you're supposed to, I guess. But as I was saying before, the way I see it, that's a waste of money and, uh, and experience points. Because from what I remember, uh, there's like a semi-boss fight once they get to the top. And hopefully, for, I mean, from what I remember, it's a, not a difficult fight whatsoever. A single giant guy and everybody just wails on him. And we are almost halfway there. Um, yep. So I guess we could probably uh, take a look at these other the pterodactyl type wyvern. So archers would be better suited against flying enemies and big soldier guys against beasts. And actually, come to think of it, um, I can't remember, I think they actually do have a giant unit to represent the boss, and I hope I don't have to wait for him to get all the way up there. Uh, we're gonna put a lonesome archer up here. Uh, actually, I don't even think we can buy some of these units yet. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, this guy. You can do it! I have faith in you! It stemmed the attack. Did I give him actions? Attack. Get him! Charge! All right, you're getting a little close. Oh no, encountered enemy. It's a battle of attrition, but I think we got him. I thought this was more automated. I mean, I do remember that you had the ability to call on different attacks and stuff, but... Like, move your guys, but, uh... Alright, yeah, I guess he's, he's doing it now. You got him. You got him. Yes. Action. Retreat. <laughs> this guy might make it out of this battle just yet. Getting awfully close, oh no. And we're gonna have our boss encounter, mini boss, whatever. Arrived at the directed position. Enemy invasion! And yeah, it looks like uh, our archer dude survived. Well, Oh my god, they're attacking! We're counting on you! Oh yeah. Um, go ahead and attack. See if he has anything to steal. I think he might have something cool to steal. 
Oh, nothing to steal. Alright. I think maybe we just, uh, get some sort of item at the end of it. I don't know. My memory, she's not what she used to be. attack. That doesn't sound good. Oh, it was just like earth. A weak ass earth. A quake. Not again. You know what? I'm not sure if we use Choco Mog for you guys yet. Anyone out there who has not seen this? Pretty high damage attack. Nice. We did it! So yeah, instead of, uh, you know, spending a whole bunch of money to do that battle, we gained 20 AP, 200 experience, and 2400 gil. Plus uh, a Vagris Claw? I'm not really sure what that is. Made it through that one somehow, but Shinra will be back. Be sure and scout the area well. We don't know when they'll attack again. So, yeah. Um. Not positive on exactly how the battles here work. Maybe it wouldn't be a bad idea to give them a donation, actually. I'm gonna donate that money that we just earned by fighting, just in case we don't make it back here and Shinra attacks again. How are things going? Seems like there's no activity at Shinra. Oh, then, is there anything you wish to ask? Funding? Oh, yeah, you guys got, got a nice little chunk of change. 3,000 for each battle, so they can fight five battles. Um, 3,000 for each battle. I'll give them um, two more battles. Five, six, seven, yeah. Alright. Nothing right now. And that was probably completely pointless, but just a little insurance policy. Which, actually, probably we don't need at all. I don't know. Gonna try to keep up on this shit, and, uh... I think even if we didn't donate anything, we would've been fine. But, that's okay. We won. We saved these crazy monk guys. We'll grab a rest real quick. Even though we didn't really take much damage. And, actually, I don't, even, I don't think we used any magic. Oh, we summoned a chocobo. The chocomog summon. Alright. Let's talk to this old guy one more time, and then we'll start making our way to the city of June. Ask my son. Yeah, he's standing guard. So, he said head north, but we pretty much want to go west. And there's not too much special about these guys. And 
and we should just about be here. There we go. What happened to this town? So